people welcome back to the overwhelmed woman i'm emma and this is a really quick video if you are feeling a little bit lowly in the job that you are doing at the moment um, or even if you feel that that work is beneath you because we're not supposed to say that but let's be honest sometimes we do things and we think this isn't us this isn't what we should be doing and um i hope that my little story about when i started to clean for people might change your thinking about the work that you are doing because um, in Life BC before I had my daughter I had some really fabulous jobs and two notable ones were as an account manager for a very famous American winery so I was overseas and schmooching and uh, you know taking people out and all of that kind of stuff and the other one was working for Virgin V who was sadly no more but used to be like Avon and um, my day job in their head office was being surrounded by skincare, jewellery, cosmetics and homeware and having involvement in um, designing some of that stuff and writing copy for it and uh, involvement with PR and training and all of that kind of thing and it was just about as fabulous a job as you could Think of having. So fast forward to being made redundant shortly before my daughter was born and my husband working a shift pattern on Brighton Beach which meant I couldn't get a regular job I became a self-employed cleaner and my first job was baptism by fire so if you've ever seen um, the young ones the house was like that and uh, the scene where Vivian um, sorry where Neil is in the bath <laughs> and the bath water is like sludge and he pulls a bike out of it <laughs> well that's what that house was like and I actually had to stop to be sick while I was scrubbing the toilet I just heaving even now thought just makes me rich and I actually remember going I'm too good for this I shouldn't be doing this this isn't me and feeling really kind of snobby actually about the whole thing and a bit aggrieved um, and over the years I continued cleaning and I also declutter, um, I started to declutter for people which is obviously what I do as part of Clutter to Clarity although that has dive bombed during Covid and uh, I um, decorated for people and even did a gift wrapping service just anything to try and earn some money um, but I started especially through the cleaning and decluttering well all of it actually to see the contribution that I was making and one of my very dear customers who is now a friend owned a beautiful house was juggling a large family and self-employed and I used to walk in and she used to go thank god you are here <laughs> and whereas some people might consider having a cleaner as a luxury to her and her well-being and her ability to keep on or keeping on with a job um, was actually meant my cleaning was a necessity for her and um, it massively changed my thought process on something that I'd always considered was a little bit demeaning for me actually and it's cleaning I has and continues to be one of the jobs that I have felt most proud to have so to all you cleaners out there big up because as we all know cleaning our own house is one thing but cleaning other people's woo totally different depending on what the house is like so um this also very quickly links to the Asda driver that delivered my food shopping last week was telling me that he used to be a very high up maths teacher in Iran prior to moving to the UK many years ago and setting up a very successful restaurant business which in the wake of Covid uh, pretty much went bump overnight and um, he said look I'm here I'm now doing this this is what I do and you could see that his old demeanor, demeanor was one of I shouldn't be doing this and you know what he shouldn't be given what he was doing but I said to him do you know what what you do for me money can't buy we're shielding especially because of Joe with his heart health someone else goes and does my shopping and fights around a supermarket with a trolley physically packs it brings it to my house and then that lovely man carries it up my drive which is like that and uh, deposits it on my doorstep for me to take into the house and I said you you make my life so much easier and the stress you take off me from not having to think about that as well as two jobs a degree j homeschooling all of that other stuff money can't buy so um look if you're feeling a bit low big yourself up because if you do a job well irrelevant of what that job is you will be contributing in some way to someone's life 
and if that doesn't make you feel good about yourself especially in the shallow world we live in then I don't know what will so a um, massive love to you all remember if you're overwhelmed you're not alone we're all overwhelmed together doing the best we can we all deserve to lead a clutter free life I'd love you to drop a like in the video and subscribe to the channel and share the love and get this overwhelmed woman up and running but until next time massive love and now I'm going to go and get a cup of tea